Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Publisher XP in 2003 do not employ the foreground and background views. Instead, everything is manipulated with layers and ordering. If you want to insert a picture as a background, simply follow the normal process for inserting a picture, and then resize and rearrange the picture as necessary to cover the amount of the background you want it to cover. Then, send the picture to the background by selecting it, then selecting Arrange from the menu bar, rolling your mouse over Order, and selecting Send to Back. If you do not have a picture you'd like to insert as the background, Publisher XP in 2003 come with a set of preset backgrounds for you to choose from. To see these, select Format from the menu bar, and then select Background. This will change your task pane to show you a list of some preset background options. In the scroll window in the task pane, at the top you will see some shading options, and if you scroll below those you'll see some pattern options, and scrolling below those you'll see a few pictures. To apply any background, simply click it and it will be applied. If you do not like the color choices available to you, you can either choose one of the previous color choices above, or you can click the More Colors link to choose a new color. And then simply reselect the shading option you'd like. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.